Oh, look at my hair. It's sticking out all over. <laughs> <laughs> we make sure we look good here. <laughs> That's kind of impossible for me. <laughs> here, Brandon and I are down here in front of the courthouse. We've got our hair all fixed up. We're trying to look good. But uh, anyway, we're doing a morning update. Uh, things are looking real good. Um, so what do we just hear here, Brand? Can you? Well, it sounds like the judge has got herself in a mess, and uh, she doesn't quite know what to do. So she's letting the defense and the prosecution meet and try to work things out. So she's not going to be the bad person or the bad guy. She she doesn't want to um, dismiss juror number eleven. Uh, Mumford filed a motion yesterday, the way I understand it, to have this uh, juror dismissed. They have called in juror number 18 to take this juror's place possibly, but uh, the judge is trying to um, excuse herself out of this decision and she's letting the prosecution and the defense team uh, discuss this while she's out of the chambers for the moment, uh, out of the courtroom, while they let them argue it out. So. We don't know exactly what's happening, but uh, this is all being discussed right now. Um, well, I know. I have a question. Uh, meanwhile, the other eleven jurors are deliberating. Is that oh, is that okay? They can do that. I, I, I think they're not supposed to be. Is that what they're doing? They're yeah. not supposed to be it's deliberating. All twelve of them, probably. Yes. Yeah, they're supposed to be all twelve of them. So yeah. hopefully, they're not deliberating. Twelve of them are they deliberating. Are Twelve of them are deliberating yes. while they're discussing this. Okay. okay, so okay. all twelve are deliberating okay. while the others are Jeez. in the courtroom. Uh, we we, <laughs> we got to keep it straight here. We're glad somebody's helping us. <laughs> so it um, so they are deliberating yet. They're continuing deliberating while they're uh, the rest of them are in the courtroom arguing. So discussing what uh, needs to be done with number eleven. So that's uh, our morning so far. Nothing real exciting down here. It's been raining. Just a uh, little treason, but nothing we shouldn't be able to handle. We can handle it. We still need people down here. And there's a couple perspectives on this uh, juror number four. At, uh, you know, he worked for the BLM for four years. And number Dave, 11. Oh, it was number yeah, 11? Number 11. Well, David up there says, well, maybe he's just trying to come clean, and he's actually in favor of the defense. So you never know. You and just, number four might be the biggest socialist yeah, on the curve. Yeah. So looks, like, looks like number 11 has been dismissed. We're just getting that news right now from Kelly. Okay. Uh, so maybe number 18 is now yeah. is now uh, a part of our jurors. So things are still going. Uh, we're just getting this news a little bit at a time down here. <laughs> but 18 is good. No more. No 11 is not in favor. So it... Um, so we're, um, but we'll keep you updated. We'll probably have you another update here at noon or sooner if there's anything real important. But uh, this is all good news. Do um, you think there's any conclusions that we can draw from any of the information that we have so far? I think I think we're going to get a not guilty. I don't know how other any conclusions we can get. Um, In the meantime, come by for lunch. My hamburgers on the front porch. Come by and raise some holy heck with us. So we'll be down here. Looks day. like uh, going to be blowing the big show tons of notes. All day. So things are going good down here. We'll keep you posted. We uh, may not know what's what Kelly going had to on say there again. At work. Eighteen women took ton women took tons of notes. Very engaged. I was noticing that myself. The women were really engaged, yeah. taking a lot of notes there during court, um, especially the last part of it. I really. Really um, noticed how they were they were on the edge of their seats taking notes, writing things down. Um, juror number one, I'm not for sure of he stayed on the juror or not, but he um, he was just sitting there. He wasn't taking any notes. So there were, but the but the women were really doing a good job. Yeah, so I right. feel good about this. I think we're gonna gonna um, gonna get a not guilty here pretty soon. So, and I think women are more engaged in this sort of thing where you got families, you know. That's just my opinion. But you got all those little kids that they've shown pictures of, and her daddies are in jail. And I think it tends to uh, women got softer hearts. Yep. When it comes to those sort of things. Yeah. So we'll keep you updated. We'll have you another one um, at noon, unless something important comes up. Um, keep praying, everybody. Uh, come down here if you can and keep supporting us. 
And we got this uh, little advertisement back here that David's doing. An appeal to heaven, the higher court. God's at work. Let's watch him. We're just one big team down here trying to bring you the news as quick as we have it. So have a good day and God bless. God bless. Thank you. Okay, the jurors are sitting home for today. We'll uh, get you an update here. What's going on down here? It's uh, sorry it's taking me so long. It's uh, right after lunch, and um, all the uh, the jurors have went home for today. They cannot continue deliberating till tomorrow. Juror number eleven has been dismissed, and um, juror number eighteen is going to take that juror's juror spot. Um, so they cannot. Do no more deliberating today until until tomorrow morning when all, all the jurors come back in. So uh, again, juror number 11 has been dismissed, and juror number 18 is going to take that juror's spot. And uh, so since there's only 11 jurors here at the courthouse today, they have uh, they have all been stopped, sent home, and stopped deliberating, and will continue tomorrow once juror number 18 comes in and takes that place um, I think things are looking real good um, the uh, lawyers all seem to be in good spirit and uh, things things are looking good also we're uh, all pleased that this one juror has been dismissed so things are looking real good things are gonna be real quiet down here by the courthouse the rest of the day there is not um, not uh, too many people down here, but everybody's heading heading back home for the day. We've got just a handful of people hanging out. So, again, tomorrow we'll be back down here early. Uh, we won't probably have any more updates today since uh, the jurors have been sent home. So it'll be again to tomorrow before we start. Uh, about 8 o'clock in the morning, I think, is when the jurors start deliberating again. So... We're all happy with how things are going, but the jurors have to start all over again deliberating from scratch um, since a new one has taken place. So this um, this this has got to start all over again. It can take up to several days again, the way it sounds. Uh, this juror number 18 took really good notes. There were several jurors that really were attentive and wrote down notes for several weeks there and did a really good job. This juror number 18 was also one of them that requested to stay and watch the deliberation from another room by a monitor if she was allowed to. And she wasn't allowed to um, do that because um, just in case something like this happened, she wasn't supposed to be watching what's going on. So things are working out the way it's supposed to. I seen a little note here from um, Jennifer Cannon that it's 8:30 tomorrow morning instead of 8 o'clock. So 8:30 tomorrow morning is when the jurors start deliberating again. Um, so things are looking real good. We still got 12 jurors going to start deliberating again tomorrow, and um, the 12 jurors will be in the courtroom at 8:30 for registration. So. I guess they got to go before the court there tomorrow morning and do what they got to do before the judge, but they'll start deliberating tomorrow, the way I understand. And um, that's when all of us will be back down here tomorrow. So I see some more notes here from Jennifer Cannon. So, so whatever they got to do, they'll be in the courtroom again tomorrow morning at 8.30. So it... Um, I will have you another update tomorrow as quick as I know, but today that's probably the last update. Pretty much everything is um, over with for today and won't have no more information yet for you. So thanks again everybody and I'll see you tomorrow uh, at 12 o'clock for sure. Take care and have a good day.
liberty. Are you a judge? Sir? Come on. Ah, love Come on we're, not, we're not going to play this, all right? We're not going to play what? I'm minding my own business. You have your flag draped over there, so it's attached to federal property right now. Okay, you're, that's, you're, making, you're making a political statement. It's just sitting that there with my stuff. That means, look. I'm not making a political statement. I do sometimes I, I ask my you to remove it, so. and if you're going to fly Who are it, you? I'm clearly marked as you a got police a card? officer, sir. And what does that do? And what does that do? I don't have to do a card. Yes, go for it. Right? Okay. Anna Brown says we don't have one. Do we? Could I? Okay, go ahead. Okay. So if it's if it's unrolled and you've got the message that you're trying to display, and it's right up next to the, uh, the federal building, and what it's displaying, it starts uh, saying a message that that your religion is greater than mine. Is that his religion is greater than mine? Uh, what we do is we keep a very neutral. Uh, atmosphere with the courthouse. The courthouse. You don't act very neutral. You act right. fairly neutral. Well, you know, I try my best. The, um, the, uh, you know, we want to keep the, the courthouse a neutral state. So when things are affixed to it, so if you sign actually up to it, it starts rep making the courthouse. Don't no sign out here. Okay. Yeah. The well, handrail is affixed. This is my property, and it's just what they Okay. Um, is that how it was? I'm just curious. It's been both ways. It's been both ways. It's been unfurled and all stuff. Okay. Um, but go, it's an exercise of my religion. Yeah, I'll go uh, talk to that side. I'll talk to you on the night because I think we can mesh a little bit better. Not guilty yet? Not guilty yet? Well, yeah, you guys have a conflicting personality. So. I usually get along with those other ones. Don't I? Oh, yeah, not too right. bad. Oh, he don't like my religion. <laughs> well, uh, Hi. How are you? Uh, they just don't like the weren't supposed to be on this property. Oh, no. I can go in. I can't go on the 19th or the... Oh, you can? I can't go on the 9th or the 13th floor. Oh, okay. Well, that's it. Okay, but you got trespass all the way across. Nope. Look, there's beautiful Julie. <laughs> oh, yeah, I've been practicing the yoga move. Have you?